Hello dear friends, I hope you are doing well. At this video, we're gonna talk about the family creation of the mullions. I mean, we're gonna create a new mullion. Here as you can see, we got some simple mullions and then I'm gonna design a profile for them. So to do this, first of all, I open a new family template file. Then I specify profile mullion to open it. Well done. Then I'm gonna sketch my desired profile by using lines for example 10 centimeters and then i extend the line in five seconds five centimeters downwards by this way three centimeters to left and then again downwards and you know the dimensions change according to the details and two centimeters for the glass placement I extend it downwards 20 centimeters and then to left very well and then I want to mirror it pick it by picking access. Well done, it is completed. But where should I put this? By using move tool. First of all, I should select the lines or the profile and then I place it at the center. But here as you can see it is mentioned center, front or back, reference plane. It refers to the grid lines of the glass. Watch this. I open the another project. It refers to the reference plane of this panel actually. So uh, let me get back to the family. So we should place or put the profile and this reference plane in a specific manner that the panel or the glass gonna be placed there. I select and then move it to here at the center by this way. So the panel or the glass is going to be placed here just between the gap. Right now we are finished with the profiles of the mullion. I save the file as, for instance, I, let me name it mullion, mullion profile, save, and then I'm gonna load it into the project, into this empty project, check this out. After that, in the continuation, I should create a new wall mullion. So I select the mullion and then in edit type, a duplication, for instance, I name it iMullion. By this way, let me assign the name. Since it seems like i, the word of i, then I specify the created profile here to my mullion. Well done. And OK. Right now, we've got a new mullion. And for modifying all of the vertical mullions of this curtain wall, we can at first select them. I mean, I select the curtain wall itself, store front, and then in edit type, you in vertical mullions, interior type. If I open the drop down list of the interior type, I can specify the I mullion, and then it will be specified for the profile. Let's check it out in the view. Here is the result. But we should move the mullion for the placement of the panel. But why did the panel is displaced from the proper position? I press tab to select the panel by this way. Again, I press tab. I select the panel. Then in edit type. Here in the type properties in offset. There is 7 millimeters offset we got here. Between the panel and the reference plane. If I specify 0. Then it will be correctly positioned in the gap as you can see. But the size of the gap is 2 centimeters, while the thickness of the panel here is 2.5 centimeters. So I minimize the thickness, 2 centimeters. Well done by this way. And you can adjust the other parts of the mullions like this for creating an accurate and professional curtain wall. If you are interested in more techniques about families, no matter 2D or 3D families, you can register the full course of family creation of mine. You can get the link in the caption and then sign up.